Hi, hello, welcome back to my channel, Govind English Teacher. Today, a great personality is with us. He is a resourceful person, a respectful speaker, and a regular speaker. He is Harish Prasapati from Nagpur. And today, we are going to discuss the important thing in our life about affirmations. So, affirmations are very, very important in our life. So, a person can be successful or failure that depends on only the, his affirmations. Affirmations are positive statements and that is to reinforce self-belief and increase self-confidence. When repeated regularly, affirmations can help to change the negative thoughts, pattern and beliefs into positive and false. So there are several ways of there on how we can affirmation. One, one, the first one is uh, it boosts self-esteem and promote positivity and reduce uh, trust and also reinforce goals, attainment and also the improve self-image and uh, overall Affirmations are powerful tools to promote self-improvement and personal growth. By incorporating affirmations into your daily routine, you can experience greater self-confidence, reduce stress, uh, and increase overall well-being. So, so with the help of uh, affirmations, we can make miracles in, in our life. Now, sir, welcome back to my channel, sir. Please react yeah. to, about your <laughs> ideas. Thank Thank you very much, so, I always say one thing. Everybody want to go to heaven, but nobody want to die. Everybody wants success, but nobody want to do hard work for that. Now, when we do talk about affirmation, affirmation is work that I would explain later. But first, we have to understand the simple thing. Until and unless, unless you don't respect of yourself, then you can't expect other will respect of you. Not at all. You don't respect of yourself, and this is the bitter fact. So what you have to do first you have to start to do your respect. Then people will respect you, definitely. Now let's come on our topic, which is the power of affirmation, or we can say that the value of affirmation. What is the value and what is the power of affirmation? It's beyond of your thinking. It is extremely great value which we can get from the affirmation. In a simple language, what affirmation is? Do talk about good about you and do appreciate you. Do talk positive with you. Now, in this case, I'm not saying to be arrogant and you are not being arrogant also. Let's say first affirmation which I have heard first in my life, which was given by Muhammad Ali. He was the greatest boxer of the century, you know. So, he said at his one interview, whenever I used to go for the, any fight, I used to tell myself, I'm the best, I'm the best, I'm the best. Whenever you are in any given task, any given exam, any given sport or anything which you feel this can be my career in next two years, five years, use this affirmation. Say always yourself, I'm the best, I'm the best. I'm not saying somebody is second to none in front of you, not at all, but you are also not second to none. You are the best and you have to tell always to yourself, I am the best. So what happened? Your subconscious mind will catch this thought and it will reflect on your personality. Your performance will be the best performance because you told yourself, I am the best. Then expectation of your body, your personality, your mind would be recaptured there. And as it would recapture, it would reflect on that performance. And this is how you would be going to give your best performance. Next affirmation, which can be given, that is I love myself. I don't want anybody who would love me. I love myself. <laughs> and because I am the precious for me. So I would always love myself. Now why? Let's say if anybody would hurt you, you get hurt. If anybody would make happy you, you would be happy. Means what the foolish thing this is. Definitely, it is not easy for me. I also kind of a common person. I am also unable to implement such kind of the thing in my life. But the bitter fact is until and unless I won't love myself, I would be depend, uh, happy upon somebody else. If somebody can make me happy, somebody can make me sad, then where is my personality? What I am? I am nothing. 
So you always need to tell yourself, I love myself, and I need not to make me happy anything. It is in my hand. If I want to be happy, I would be happy. If I want to be sad, I would be sad. Nobody can decide my happiness, my sadness, and my personality. My result, everything is in my hand. Next is just say yourself, I have work ethic. Tell truth to yourself. I am the person who believe in a power which I have. If I don't have power, I would increase. I would talk. I would just appreciate myself. I'll not wait to appreciate other. If other would appreciate, then only I will be happy. No, this is silly thing. You should not wait for anything. Fourth one is to analyze yourself. As we always give this a fact to analyze yourself. In which what you can do, check out. I did yesterday affirmation. Am I getting positivity or not? If am I not getting positivity, then why? And I believe that each and every time you get positive positivity, when do you appreciate yourself? When do you affirmation? So definitely there would be a way of affirmation through get transformation. Now number five, and that is one of the relevant fact, and it is a universal fact. Let's say if you do help to somebody else, how do you feel? You feel good, but you know what happened? You give lots of advice to lots of people, but when it comes to you, you don't implement. This is the irony. This is the irony. In this, what you have to do? Let's say the advice which you are giving to somebody else. Why don't you implement on you? And the last tip which I would like to give you. Let's say whenever you are in worry, whenever you are in a problem, when you think I can't do anything else, you have to do only one thing. And what exact thing that is? Let's say you might have idol. So many people, such as somebody. Idol can be Swami Vivekananda or Mahatma Gandhi, Doctor Ambedkar, Periyar, Ramanujan. Anybody else can be your idol, Mother Teresa. Imagine that if I would be seated with the Mother Teresa, Gandhi, Ambedkar, then I would share my problem with them. This exactly problem. Then what kind of advice they could give me? What is top? With do this two way and get advice through imagination. Once you get advice, implement in your life without any obstacleity. You will be going to successful. The simple meaning of affirmation is just do talk to do talk good with you. Be positive with you. That's what from my side, sir. Please add something. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your great inspiring words regarding the affirmation. So let me just come to within a few words, you know. So affirmation is, is nothing but just I have come across a, a great uh, mantra, sir. That is the thirteen words mantra. So the mantra that made a, a, a person a great because the person who wanted to kill himself, suicide himself. But actually, by chanting the mantra, he became greatest one, and he is another. But actually, by chanting the mantra, he became greatest one, and he is another. Then I think he is the Charlie Chaplin, you know. So he is he, he, he always think that. Day by day, in all the way, I am getting better and better and fine. Day by day, in all the way, I am getting better and better and fine. So when he repeatedly uh, chanting this mantra, automatically that uh, mantra made him so driven force towards his perfection, towards his uh, prosperous and progress in the future. So so I can say that uh, uh, past is full of tears, future is unclear. Our fear, but present is clear. So we have to use the present time, which is given by a God, like a presentation. If you use the present time in a proper way, prosperous way, progress way, automatically, and uh, you can make a miracles in our life. And no God, no teacher, no parent, no nothing will uh, help you. You have to push yourself. So that means uh, your attitude, the way of thinking, your affirmations that uh, leads to success or failure. So you can make anything. By reinforcing your affirmations, uh, you can translate, uh, transfer from negative to positive, so you can progress in your future. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your uh, yeah, great words and good right. words. Thank yes, you for sir. your uh, you sharing your uh, time and sparing your good knowledge. Thank you, sir. It's good. Thank you.